Pal. Structure Activity Relationships SAR, in Medicinal Chemistry Hey everyone! Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into one of the most fundamental concepts in medicinal chemistry, Structure Activity Relationships or SAR. Let's get started. So, what exactly is SAR? In simple terms, SAR is the relationship between the chemical structure of a molecule and its biological activity. This concept is crucial because it helps scientists understand how changes in a molecule's structure can affect its ability to interact with biological targets, like proteins or enzymes. Imagine you have a basic drug molecule. By modifying different parts of this molecule, like adding or removing certain chemical groups, scientists can observe changes in its biological activity. These modifications help optimize the drug's effectiveness and minimize any potential side effects. For instance, let's say we have a molecule with a hydroxyl group, OH. By replacing this group with a different functional group, like a methyl group, CH3, we might see a change in how the molecule interacts with its target. This is the essence of SAR, understanding how these structural changes influence activity. In medicinal chemistry, SAR studies are a continuous process. Scientists create analogs, slightly different versions of the original molecule, to study their effects. By analyzing these analogs, they can determine which structural features are essential for biological activity. Some common functional groups to remember include Hydroxyl, OH can increase solubility in water Methyl CH3 can affect the molecule's binding affinity. Amino, NH2 can enhance interactions with certain biological targets. Carboxyl, COOH often involved in hydrogen bonding. An example of SAR in action is the optimization of beta blockers. By modifying the structure of initial beta blocker compounds, Scientists were able to develop drugs with improved selectivity and fewer side effects, like atenolol and metaprolol. Now, let's touch on some key terms you'll encounter when studying SAR. Bioactivity, this refers to the effect a compound has on living organisms. It's a crucial measure of a drug's effectiveness. Lead compound. This is a chemical compound that shows promise in biological activity and serves as a starting point for further development. Analog, these are compounds that are structurally similar to a lead compound but have slight modifications. They're often tested to see if they can improve efficacy or reduce toxicity. Efficacy, this term describes how well a drug produces its desired effect. A compound with high efficacy will have a strong biological response. Potency. Potency refers to the amount of a drug needed to produce a specific effect. A potent drug requires a lower dose to achieve its effect compared to a less potent one. Understanding SAR is essential for anyone in medicinal chemistry. It's a powerful tool that helps in the design and development of safer and more effective drugs. So, whether you're a student or a professional in the field, mastering SAR concepts is key. Thanks for joining us today. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and check out our other videos on medicinal chemistry. Happy studying, and see you next time.